Hello viewers, welcome to Pebbles. Uh, today we are going to learn new topic that is Abacus. Okay, it's a simple counting machine and counting device and it's very useful for children by simple learning counting numbers uh, with bright color beads. Okay, I will show you the Abacus instrument and how to move the beads and count the numbers okay let me enjoy children and uh, today uh, we are uh, that is we are going to learn uh, in a joyful manner how to move the beads by using abacus okay i will show you the first i will show the instrument and uh, do you know the basic what is abacus and the rod type okay first you have to understand what is abacus I will show the uh, simple uh, that is uh, this is this video is for preschool children from the age level up to 4, 5 and 6 ok 4 to 7 age level children are enjoying for this uh, using this device by using how to use this device I will show you the device ok this is a mathematical simple abacus device okay and each row that is it has 10 rods okay how to move this to know that is 10 rods and by counting numbers okay you have to start from the bottom to up okay this is a device okay for 10 rods this is count by this is 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 and 10 this is a abacus kit and it has 10 rods and each rod has 10 beads okay this is a 10 beads abacus and this is a 100 beads abacus this is called 100 beads because each row contains 10 beads okay that is 10 rods okay children and each row contains 10 beads okay so 10 into 10 that is 100 so this is called 100 beads abacus and uh, which has bright colored beads okay do you love children because by simply you have to sliding the beads from right to left and you are uh, knowing to counting how to count the numbers and place the numbers okay and this is called the zero level okay do you understand this this is a zero level abacus that is no movement of beads here okay do you understand this uh, for reference because this is one okay you are moving in the ones place you move just like one number this is called one okay and next one is a tens place and hundred place and it grows upward the up to uh, next level units okay first you have to counting simple counting by using this from the ones place okay do you start okay from this basic rod okay okay i will show uh, in the board for how to move and do you understand what is basic bead movement of on abacus okay let me see that is what is abacus it is a simple mathematical device okay i will show for single that is only one's place okay so i have to draw two beads okay one and two so how do you say the number how do you say the number this is the answer that is you say two because one's place rod it has two beads okay do you understand and next one here listen here this also one's place rod okay this is one's place rod for o o represent ones okay listen here one two three four and five how do you say now count the beads so one two three four five the answer is five okay do you understand 
Okay, I will show you next example. This is also a once place rod. Okay, I have to draw beads. Listen here. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So, simply you have to count the beads and say the answer. The answer is 7. Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So, answer is 7. Okay. Do you understand? And next one. This also one's place rod. Okay. Listen here. 1, 2, 3, and 4. By counting this number, you have to say the answer. What is the answer? 4. Because 1, 2, 3 and 4. So, answer is 4. Okay. And next, that is simple ones place rod. Okay. Here, listen here, there is no beads at all here. Okay. I didn't write any bead. I didn't draw any bead. What is the answer? There is no bead. You have to say zero. Okay. This is answer zero. Because there is no beads on the rod in one's place. So, simply by doing moving abacus. That is moving beads on abacus. You have to count the numbers. Four, two, five, seven. And here is. 0. Okay. Next I have to show. Next up uh, that is next place. That is one's place. Okay. We have discussed one's place. And simply doing Okay. Next we are going to learn that is two place. That is one's place and the tens place. Okay. Listen here. I have to draw that is ones place and tens place. Okay. Draw two rods. Okay. By simply drawing here three beads and here one bead. So what is the answer now? First count the beads in ones place. First you count the beads on first ones place rod. Say the answer 3 and the tens place rod it has only one bead. Okay children do you understand now? This is ones place and this is tens place. First you should write the beads number of beads in ones place only. Okay so count the beads and write down the answer is 3. And next you have to count the beads on tens place that is 1. So answer is 13. Do you understand? Okay. Let me move on. Next example. Simply that is ones place and tens place. It has two rods. Okay. I have to draw. Okay. Let me start to count. First count the ones place number. Okay. Ones place rod. It has one. 2. So, answer is 2. And next you have to count the beads on tens place. So, 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. You have to write the number. What do you say now? This is 52. Okay. So, so, so this is a simple counting method. And let me know how to count. Uh, Form a pattern in abacus that is counting by twos, counting by fives and counting by tens. Let me enjoy with abacus. Okay.